Hello everyone, my name is Kane, and today we will be playing the best game ever. Star Wars Galaxies. No, I'm just kidding. But it is my favorite game ever, and Jump to Lightspeed is one of the expansions. This game was the greatest thing ever back when I played it in 2005, 2006, before WoW. Oh, loud music is loud. Sorry about that. My sound was turned up way too loud, and that probably blew out most of your eardrums. I apologize. Now, where was I? Oh yes, greatest game ever. This game, Star Wars Galaxies, made by Sony. Yeah, I know, right? They actually did something right? Not really, and I'll get to that later. But for the most part, this game was amazing. Is amazing through the emulator, although there's not that many people playing right now. Hint, hint. Get this. Get on it. Get playing. Now, you may be asking yourself, how do I get this amazing game that's been dead for so long and is no longer available? The answer? eBay. Internet. Amazon.com. Stuff like that. Uh, and let me show you. All you have to do is go to Amazon.com or eBay. Either one. They both have it. Get a real copy. You can't torrent it. It won't work off torrents. That's just the way the emulator is. Now, once you have a copy, I would suggest Amazon, it's cheaper. Uh, you go to the Star Wars Galaxies emulator website, swgemu.com. Go to the forums, go to the home, and then go to an area about SWIG, install SWGMU. It'll bring you to a step-by-step -step guide, really simple, on how to get the game, installing it, downloading it, etc., etc., getting all the way up to playing it. Real easy, real simple, and once you have it, you're in. You're done. You can play. Uh, this game, made by Sony, I say that again too many times, anyways, great game, nothing matches it, full sandbox, MMORPG, better in the Old Republic made now, better in WoW, better in any of that back in its heyday. It is now dead, the official version, because Star Wars Old Republic took its copyright claim. LucasArts is like, no, no more for you, SOE. You fucked up, and guess what? We're giving it over to these guys, Bioware. Bioware, great job, great company, but I kind of dropped the ball in the Old Republic, so I'm playing this again, and I'm the only one out of my friends who is. We are treated to a great cinematic here on the front. I'm kidding, the graphics are terrible, but back when it was created, this was, you know, pretty standard. I will let this roll, and you can enjoy for a minute. Amazing graphics. Am I right? Yeah, 2005 hasn't aged well, has it? Anyways, I'm just gonna type in my username and password here. Hmm, look the other way. Please? Fan. Okay, so here's my first character. This was the name of the character I used back in the day. This is Emulator, it's a new server, and for this video, I'm creating a brand new character just for you guys. And yes, that was a Wookiee. Guess what? Wookiees are awesome. Um, I don't want to play in the test center. That's where all the stuff's buggy, not everything's working, and they're working on it. Give them time. So I'm going to play on this server here. I know it's fairly well done. Um, I think I'm going to play... I don't know. First, I should start out by saying there's quite a few species here. I mean, not that many when you think about it, but more than usual. You got your standard human, your Rodian, your Mon Calamari, Han shot first. 
you got your Bothans, your Wookiees, your Twi'leks, Trandoshans, Zabrak, Ithorian, and Solasta. Now all of these you can pick, play, customize however you want. This game's got a great in-depth customization system. Um, but before you pick just for the looks, there's also something to be aware of. All the classes have different stats to start with. Completely different. And it's it's a good idea to pay attention to this. Um, Mon Calamari, all about the crafting. All about the crafting. But if you look over here, Medic also. In this game, there's not just health and maybe mana, played WoW. There's health, action, and mind, and multiple stats that affect them. So I'll explain those later, but for now, just know that crafting, Mon Calamari, yes. Medic, yes. Anything else? Mm, just for fun, I guess, if you want to yell, it's a trap a whole lot. Um, I'm going to pick a Zabrak for now. Why? Darth Maul owns. Simple as that. Oh, that's an ugly start, isn't it? Look at that. That face. That terrible paint job in those eyes. Let's fix this. Alright, I'll start with the body. Why not? Um, you have a lot of choices here. You can slide it up, slide it down. Muscles, no muscles. Some muscles. All muscles, no muscles. Tall, short, tall, short, halfway. Uh, you can make him as fat as you want. Or super... Sh you can't really go too skinny, I guess, but... Other races, it varies. But for Zabrak, we're just gonna go with... Tall as I can, a little bit of weight, a little bit of torso, and a little bit of muscle. I don't want him looking too ridiculous. Face. Let's leave him at the standard age. Lips. Big lips, poofy lips, small lips. And right in the middle. Mouth, small mouth. Now, many of you may be asking, why are we watching this crap? Why are we watching you make a character? Well, I'm trying to make a point. This is, this game has so many options for customization. I played this game for years, and it was hard to find a character that looked exactly the same. You'd always find a small detail. Usually big details, but small details nonetheless. Um, it's a great customization system. I'm just going to go through it really quick, as quick as I can, just to give you an idea of all the options you can have. So you got sizes of ears, face, cheeks. I'm just going to go pretty standard with everything. I don't want to spend too much time on it. Chin, mouth, eyes and nose. Uh, blood red eyes. Creepy looking. Or you can go with that Sith yellow later on, but not really right now. There's many customizations options after you create your character well past what's offered right now. I'm going to go with red eyes. Why not? Eye size. Really surprised. Beady eyes. Uh, we'll go with that. I like my characters to look a little angry. So we're going to try and catch that. Nose length. Uh, medium. Width. Right about there. Nose protrusion. Which means long nose, short nose, long nose, snub nose. Kinda in between. Freckles. No freckles. Sorry, I'm not a ginger hater. But I don't like my characters with freckles. I'm not apologizing. Uh, tattoos. Let's get rid of this crappy tattoo and the coloring. Let's go something. Jerk. Um, is there a black? I can't remember. There should be. There's a darker black that you can get later after you make your character, but I don't remember. Ah, that looks good enough. A little lighter skin color. Right about 
there. Tattoo style. Yes, they do have a look-alike Darth Maul tattoo. You weren't hallucinating. They did do it. Not exactly. They didn't want to get too crazy. Here it is right here. But you can look similar. I am not doing that. I want to look a little different. I like this because it kind of looks like a skull. But just okay, he winked at me. I'm officially creeped out. Turning the face away just enough. Horns and hair. Zabrak, they're all about the horns. There used to be hair along with it, but it's the emulator and they don't have everything exactly, so he's staying bald for now. Darth Maul horns. We're gonna go away from the Darth Maul horns. Um, I like this one. It's kind of like a crown. I'm gonna go with like a dark gray brown. Brown is what I meant to say. Don't know where I got gray. Face, age, lips, went over that. Over it, over it, over it, over it, over it. Alrighty. Done. Alright, so when you start the game, you get your base classes. There are six of them. You got your artisan, crafter. Yes, I said it. An entire profession, just crafting. We'll get more into that later, but just know, it's awesome. Brawler, you got your melee guy. You know, unarmed, swords, two-handed, pull-arm, brawler. Entertainer, again, like the crafting system, you can play this entire game as an entertainer, a dancer, or a musician. Yeah, I know little odd, but it's better than it sounds. It really is. It's kind of cool after you think about it for a while and watch the game. Marksman. I really shouldn't need to explain this, and he's crying in the corner because he wasn't picked. Um, Marksman. Sniper. Carboneer. Pistolier. Yeah. Pretty obvious there. Medic. Healer. Priest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scout, outdoorsy, you know, creatures, stuff like that. It's hard to explain. I'll talk more about it later. I am going to start out... Oh, Marksman. I think I want to start shooting stuff and flex. Ooh, terrible name, and I don't know what that little animation was. Tossing back hair that wasn't there. Getting kind of weird here. Name, name, name. Yeah. Yeah. We'll go with it. Alright, you can make a character biography here or in the game later. It really doesn't matter. You got your overdue view of your character name, whether you want the tutorial or not. I'm going to show it. Just cause, just for the people out there. You know what? Never mind. No, we're we're skipping the plan below. Skills just shows you what you are. Attributes it shows everything you're gonna have at the beginning, health-wise, all your bars. And that's about it. Let's get into it. Oh, that's unfair. That's that's just no. Why? 